Hey guys, so I'm back, yeah. Sorry, my camera cut out, but I just, because I didn't have enough storage on it, I just um, deleted all the trash and threw it out, or, you know, the lodge files and um. But it's, everything's on YouTube, so everything's legit now. Um, and I was mentioning in my previous video regarding my disability how I want to go to Bronx guy. I want to go to East, specifically the East Bronx guy. And there's a specific reason for this guy's um, White Castle, okay? I've always wanted to try the real White Castle, not the frozen stuff. Now, I mean, I'm from New England, the Boston area, the Great Boston area, and we don't have White Castle here, guys, right? So the closest one is in the East Bronx. And, um,. So that's the closest part of New York City that's close to me. <coughs> so I plan on visiting East Bronx because I, I want to go to White Castle. I'm not just try the frozen, but I want to frozen two books. I want to try, you know, the 1921 burgers, the, the chicken fries, you know, they got desserts, everything, you know, the mozzarella stick, everything. I want to try the whole shebang. But um, here's, here's my plans if I do go, guys. Now I'm in a better position to go now. If I do go, I'll probably have to tough it out a little, but I'm a little bit of position to go now. But I want to wait till I see a neurosurgeon and get a CAT scan for my brain. Because hopefully I'm going to be 80 85% better. Hopefully the neurosurgeon will be able to help me out. And then I'll be even in a better position to go to these box, to the White Castle. So, now here's what I'm going to do when I get there, guys. So i gotta take a, I got to take a bus there, okay? And um, now when I go there, they got a big, beautiful mall. Okay, uh, the Co-op City Mall, or, I, I, or Baychester Mall, I'm not sure, and, um, they got a lot of nice stores in there, and I'm going to check it all online, see which, um, which stores I want to check out, so I'm going to map out what stores I want to check out, you know, I don't know how long I want to spend in there, and, um, it's good, if you go on a hot day, you know, you're going to stay cool, and, uh, I'm going to check that out, and then I'm going to go to White Castle, okay, I'm going to pick out, right? and then when I feel so full that I'm going to go to movie theaters and <laughs> food digest. I'm going to watch a movie, guys. I take it easy, enjoy the movies. And if for some reason I feel tired because if I have because of my disability, because I don't know how I'm going to be, you know, um, or or if I feel like I need to take a nap, I can take a nap in the movie theater and I want to rent a motel or anything, you know. And uh, yeah, I'll just. Because you can rent out those, uh, those reclining chairs, you can sleep on them, and, um, yeah, it's, it, it's, it's, it's wonderful, guys, you know, those, those chairs are awesome, you just lay back, and if you feel tired, you just sit there in the movie, and what, yeah, so what I'll do is, if I feel tired, regardless of the disability, because I just feel tired, you know, because sometimes I feel dizzy after, after I'm tired, too, but, like I said, after I see the middle of the circuit, I don't know how I want to be, but I'm not going to just, damn disability stopped me from going there. Okay, and uh, and I'm just gonna, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, just watch a movie if I fall asleep, I fall asleep, you know, if I, you know, if I get a little sick, you know, I'll hopefully it won't come to that. But uh, I'm gonna, you know, it, I'm usually going in twice every five to seven days instead of every seven days, so what I'm gonna try to do, guys, is, um, I'm, I'm gonna try to, um, because this is what happens, guys, and this is what, it, I'm gonna try to vomit the day before for as long as I can to get it all out of my system. So I won't be vomiting for another whatever how many days. This way when I go there the next day, I'll be good. I shouldn't vomit or nothing. I might feel a little dizzy, but yeah. But like I said, if I see the neurosurgeon, yeah, then you know, it might help me out. Oh, it's cold now. We got air conditioning running, sorry. Oh. <sighs> well, yeah, so, now, I'm going to go there, my plan is I'm going to wake up at, at 3, 3.30 in the morning, okay, maybe 4 in the morning, and I'm going to take an Uber to South Station in Boston, Massachusetts, and I'm going to take the train from there, the first train to come, I think it's like 5 o'clock in the morning, right, this way by the time I get to New York, it will be still early in the morning, 9 a.m. or 9.30, and I'll have the whole day to myself. I have the whole day to myself, you know, to enjoy myself, and the, the AMC theaters, right, and so when I go there at the White Castle, um, uh, probably the first movie I'm gonna fall asleep, I'll watch the first movie I'll probably fall asleep, and what I'll do is when the movie's over, I'll just go out and get another ticket for another movie, 
or maybe I'll watch the same movie again. If, you know, if it's a good movie, maybe I'll watch it again and buy another ticket. And, and what I'll do is I'll, because they're, they're movies, the last movie show is like 9, 30, 10. So what I'm going to do is um maybe stay there for like, uh, I don't know, maybe stay there for like three or four shows, maybe three shows, you know, and uh, just enjoy the movies. Now, there's a park over there. I don't know. It's, it, or there's a beach over there called Orchard Beach, but I'm not sure if it's part of Pelham Park. I'm not sure if, if, if that's the name of the park where Orchard Beach is, but I plan on going there, right? And I'm gonna, I, you know, I'm gonna have a backpack with me, and I'm gonna get one of those small, light sleeping bags that you can easily fold up. I mean, you can easily fold up from your backpack and um, or put, you know what I mean? It's not one of those big, big ones, the heavy ones. And um, you know, you know, go there and, and camp out at Orchard Beach or Orchard Park, and uh, they have benches there, and just put, or if I'll put it on the ground or whatever, and I'll sleep in the um, the tent, and I'll just you know, put on my headphones and listen to the news in New York City, you know, or whatever, and you know, or the music from I'll listen to New York. I'll specifically make sure I listen to New York City radio stations because uh, like Ten Ten Winds is one of them. And um, yeah, and, and uh, I'm I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a video for you guys. Um, I hope nothing bad happens to me. That's something I tell. I hope I hope nothing bad happens to me. I'm gonna be okay. Um, you know, you gotta take chances in life, and uh, and so yeah, so you know, after the movie theater's over, I'll walk to this Orchard Beach, which isn't too far away. I, I see the instructions on Google Maps. I can check out my phone and I go there and I'll sit there, watch the beach for a while, listen to my, you know, one's ten times or whatever, and um, take it out. You know, hopefully, no one's gonna kill me or anything. Yeah, I mean, not take it out, but you know, camp out in a sleeping bag, you know, but hopefully, I won't get bothered by cops because I'll just <laughs> say, hey, I'm just having, you know, taking a little saunter in New York City. For the first time in my life, guys. And um, now, there's a road that when you go into um, when you go into uh, East Bronx, there's a road called Boston Road, and it's gonna take you right over the bridge from Pelham, I think it is. And the first thing you're gonna see, you're gonna see a Dunkin' Donuts, you're gonna see uh, McDonald's, and if you walk down the street that way, you're gonna, cause New York City is known for its tall high rises, the housing projects, the nature, you can see just big ass housing high rise there and uh, they're all over the place guys and uh that's what makes new york new york you know so uh, anyway so after the orchard park after i came out at the orchard park i'm you know i'm gonna fall well, asleep sleep whatever seven hours if i can hopefully because i don't know if i'm good sleeper outside but uh and then I'm gonna, there's a Dunkin' Donuts, and when I wake up, I'm gonna go to this Dunkin' Donuts, guys, there's a nice Dunkin' Donuts there, and uh, have my coffee, and uh, a light breakfast, uh, because I don't wanna eat too much, I'm gonna have a light breakfast, and uh, I'm gonna, we get a wake up there, you know, wake me up. And then I'm gonna walk to Pelham Parkway, guys, here. Pelham Parkway, it's friggin' beautiful, guys. It's like a park, it's in between, it's like an island, it's in between two, two long, two streets, right, and, um, there's a hospital on one side, Jacoby Hospital, and then there's a, on the other side is a lot of brick tenement buildings, um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna walk in, like, the middle of the park, cause I wanna get, I wanna get videos of these brick buildings, right, the tenement buildings, like, New York City, same for it, right? and then, and then, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut halfway through the middle of the park and I'm gonna I'm gonna walk on the side where the hospital is, across from the hospital. I might even go inside the Jacoby Hospital and, and do a little filming. But it's not for too long, just to show you the inside guys. And um and then I'll I'll, I'll cut back onto the other part of um the Pelham Parkway where um where the where the houses are, you know, the tenements and keep on walking until I get to the um the White Plains Road Avenue, where they have this train station that goes over. Once you go in and eat that train station, guys, it's the West Bronx. Now, the West Bronx is more dense, it's more crowded, it's it's more busy, uh, it's more populated. So, that's why I, another reason why I want to stick to the East Bronx, okay? And, yeah, it's more hustle and, hustle and bustle, it's a lot more energy. And then, so, once I get there, 
I'm gonna um walk back from um in the reverse direction from White Plains train station to in the reverse direction where I came from on Pelham Parkway and I'm gonna I think it's called Gun Hill Road now. Guys have you ever heard of checkers? So checkers guys I never had checkers. There's a checkers there and I wanna try checkers really bad. So I'm gonna go to the checkers guys. Yep, I'm gonna get checkers for for lunch and um can't wait guys I, I i hope this comes to fruition i hope i'm just not talking out i'm talking out my mouth because i have a strong desire to do this i don't know why guys and um and then uh yeah and then i'm gonna probably go back to the movie theaters again and uh i don't know watch another movie or if i don't want to go back to the movie theaters maybe i'll just hop on a greyhound and um yeah hop on a greyhound and and go home and uh and then another time maybe and then maybe on a different occasion i'll i'll come back because i want to go into the borough of queens because they have jolly bee there guys so there's stuff in new york city they don't have here anymore so yeah maybe the or or i might just do maybe i'll stay there another day and just go to jolly bee the next day i don't know what i'm gonna do it depends on my mood guys but uh yeah i'm really looking forward to these points uh it, you know, i'm hoping it happens guys uh Right now, it's just uh, it's just uh, an idea that I'm having. You know, it's just a, a wish that I'm having, a desire, that's what you want to call it. Um, but yeah. So yeah, guys. So uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, wish me luck with my with my health, with my disability, with my hopefully I'll be able, wish me luck. Hopefully, I'll be able to go to Bronx, guys. And, uh, okay, guys. Peace out. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.